Hey guys, in this video today, I want to show you a very cool way how you can use Final Cut Pro's hand drawing animations and create your own database of animations that you can now use in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad. So I show you what I mean. We have Final Cut Pro and you probably have seen like Final Cut Pro is not really that pro, but I don't want to talk about this in this video, but it has one feature it is amazing for. It is called the hand drawing animation. So I can hit this icon here on the top and now I can use my pencil and draw something and it will actually animate whatever I draw here. So I hit done. So now I have this clip here and I see all of my animations here done. And the way we will work with this is we create just a black background because usually what you would do, let's say you have your video clips here and you hit this icon with the drawing and now you can draw stuff in here like you want and then say done. And now the problem here is we only have, we can only export this as a video and not as a transparent background, or we cannot export this as an individual clip. But what we can do is we can actually bring this down here to the bottom, delete the first one, and now we only have the animation and we can render out this animation with the black background. By the way, if you want to make it faster or slower, you can always click this, go to an inspector, and then you see here, draw on. If I decrease this, everything will be faster. Right or if I make this longer, the animation will take more times, more seconds, no, super, super slow. Let's just keep this around 2.5 or something. So now we can hit here, export video. And for that one, we only need the video only. So not video and audio, just video. Those settings for me is okay. So I say export and now I can save this video. Okay. Now I can go to DaVinci Resolve on the iPad and bring in this clip. It will sa be saved now here on the photos, this one. And the way this works now is you have to bring this into your timeline. Let's say here, for example, now we have the animation, but it's still black, right? And you have to come here to the effects, 3D keyer and drag and drop the 3D keyer to this clip here now. And it's super, super simple. You go to, go to the inspector under effects and we can hit here this plus icon. And to make this work, you have to change this setting here from transform or whatever to open FX overlay. And now with the plus icon, we can select the black color. Boom, one click and the black color is gone. That means now we have a transparent and we have this as an animation. So my idea is, I know we hate subscriptions, right? But you could sign up for Final Cut Pro for one month, create all the animations that you want, that you rethink and redo and recreate, export them out with a black background, and then you have your own catalog of animations, handmade animations that you created, that you now can use in future projects and bring them into DaVinci Resolve just with the black background. And you just have to use this one effect and you have the transparent background. This is amazing. I hope you learned something today. If yes, hit like, subscribe, ding on ding on the bam bang gong, and we see us in the next video. I'm Daniel, bye.